Uh, all right. Uh, back to GBL. Back to GBL. We're doing all right. We're doing all right. Let's do it again. Let's see if we can find some more wins. We are, uh, we're dangerously close to, uh, what is it? 2,500 all of a sudden. Dangerously close. All right, Jeffrey. Good luck, Jeffrey. What's Jeffrey got? Florges into Haxorus. Yeah, we like that. That's pretty nice for us. They're going to immediately go to a Metagross, which is fine. I think it would have been in our best interest here to go to um, Snorlax instead, but I think this is okay. Psychic would be unfortunate if they have it. Okay, they're not doing the, uh, they're not doing the fancy Psychic play. This isn't the world's worst matchup. It's just not one you really want to be in. But they shouldn't get another Meteor Mash here. Okay. And this Haxorus has the awkward uh, problem of needing to farm us, which it has a hard time doing given that we resist counter. So I'm expecting double steal and it is a little awkward double steal is a oh we got the defense drop let's go oh hey hi yeah that's a steel type and we could definitely tank a what we take one wild charge so I'm actually not gonna shield this yeah there's the wild charge fine I actually don't think they're going to shield at all. Um, I probably should just be YOLOing superpowers at them, but no, they're, they're, they're in it. They're in it to win it. Apparently. Ah, there's the mirror shot. Fine, 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 fine. Their problem here is that this fight is going to take a lot out of them. So. There's the other shield. You know, get me. There's the mirror shot. That's not going to kill me. Okay. The downside for them is that they're still in range to die to any random move off Florges. So this is all, this is all neat maneuvering and stuff, but it's not going to work. <laughs> I'm not going to have to shield anything out of this and they're going to die to a moon blast and we have a shield in case they do have. Oh yeah. They've got dragon claw and night slash. Yeah. This is not going to work out for you. Yeah. I've already seen both its moves chilling. So I'm not worried. I'm not worried about earthquake because I've seen both of its moves. <laughs> And it didn't, it didn't pretend like it had Earthquake. I think people don't realize or f remember Earthquake's an option for it. So they don't faint. They don't actually like pretend Earthquake. So. I mean, obviously that was, that was pretty good for us. Um, good lead, good safe swap. They were double steal in a tricky way, but like. That's pretty okay. Good old Surf Earthquake. Let's go. I like that idea. Do it. Uh, you just you just charge up to Earthquake level of Energy Butler. Gary. Okay. Dragon Breath would be nice. I'd like a Dragon Breath Gary here. Show me Dragon Breath Gary. Oh, oh boy, that's a mistake. Um, shit. Okay, 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 okay. Mistakes were made. We're not supposed to shield. We're supposed to just throw on, no shield and throw on one. So I put myself in a hole here. That's, uh, that's just, that's me being distracted. Okay. Game's still winnable, but being in the hole here, a shield is bad. 
The upside for us, okay, it is a Dragon Breath Gary, so our floor just is much better against this than it would be against Waterfall. But I am expecting their back mon. Ooh, that's a nice, that's a nice defense drop there. Yeah, see, their back mon is Metagross. That's the problem, right? So now we have to now we have to kill this from behind a shield, which is really a lot more challenging. Like a lot more challenging. Hmm. Yeah, the problem here is that uh I don't know that it's I don't know it's gonna make a difference. <laughs> they're not even they're not even shielding the uh the body slams. Wow. They do still have to throw a move to kill me? Oh, they're not shielding anything. Okay, well, I like that. I mean like This feels very sus. I mean, I guess they might be able to kill me with Aqua Tails before I, uh... I am going to throw. The, uh, the one-turn Dragon Breasts I don't think are going to make a lot of difference here, and there's a good chance we get to three moves. Now, if they're on Hydro Pump, we lose, obviously, but I'm okay with that, frankly. I don't think they're on it. They've thrown Crunch and Aqua Tail at me, so... But they need another Aqua Tail to kill me, so. Even this Aqua Tail, I don't know, kills me. Okay, that died. Thanks. And now we win. I mean, it was very, very, very awkward here, but I just, you can't let your Pokemon get that low. It just makes it really hard to win. Like, yeah, you have a shield, but then you just end up shielding like the crappiest, crappiest moves. So it feels, it feels pretty bad. Obviously, that game should have been much easier. We definitely made a pretty bad mistake to make that game close. Um, let's not do that again. We're not supposed to shield there. That's not the play pattern. Uh, Garchomp, another dragon lead. Let's go. Dragon double steal all the way top to bottom today, please. Into it. Okay. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to Moonblast and then I'm going to the Lax. Um, I think there's a good chance that this team has a, uh, a Steel type on it. And I think Gary will be valuable. Mine's not a hundo either, Cooking. Mine's just a lucky. It's a lucky 98, but it's a lucky. I mean, this is just a slugfest, right? Like, no fast move damage. You don't really want to throw the superpower first because it won't kill. And then their opposing superpower is way, way, way better. But we are up a shield. Oh, there's the superpower for them. Okay. Ah, maybe this time if they've got two. It's a little tight here at the end. Nope, there's a body slam. Uh, it, lucky reduces the amount of stardust you have to spend to build it. That's really what it does. If the Garchomp has Fire Blast... Ah, interesting. 
we could be in some trouble. But that's not fire. That's no way that's fire blast energy. I'm mean, earth power is going to hit, right? But I do have to respect the fact that we're going to take some damage from an earth power. Like it's not, it's not a nothing move. But I'm just going to moon blast this thing. Okay, they body slam away. That's fine. Yeah, Butler, I don't I, I don't know that they're just gonna make all leagues available all the time. And show me your back, Mon. Can we beat it? It is a Gary, and it's probably waterfall as well, so we're gonna win that one. GG's, let's go. Yeah, I can confirm that you want 15 attack, especially as I have a 14, 15, 15 Excadrill. That's really obnoxious. <laughs> it's really, really obnoxious. Uh, that actually would be cool, Hoff. Yeah, I would really like that. Um, being able to do the GBL formats. Um, maybe. If we get one more win in the set, we might we might hit 2,500, yeah. Doing the GBL formats in friend battles would actually be really cool. That actually is a nice feature request. Maybe we could do that. Maybe that's an option. I'll suggest it. I actually do like that feature. I don't know how complicated it would be to, to do, but it would be nice. Blinds Mare. Good luck, friend. What do you got? Florgis. Dragonite. Solid. We like that. Uh, what's coming in and should we chip it? Nope. No chip. We just go. And this time we know that we know the play pattern. Yes. No shield. Throw the Aqua Tail. No shield. Throw the Aqua Tail. I think whatever's in GBL would be would be more reasonable. I think if you try and do everything, that gets that's too that's too many. But uh, whatever's in GBL right now should be sendable as a friend battle. That seems totally reasonable. Okay. I mean, this looks like Dragonite Double Steel, right? There's like a very high probability. Oh no! Oh no! It is. Wait. Oh no! Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, we're not gonna get to the crunch, so we'll just throw the uh, we'll throw the Aqua Tail. Throw the old Aqua Tail. It's not great. It doesn't really do anything, but we might as well get that damage in. And look, it's a Metagross. <laughs> Huzzah. You know, you know my favorite thing about uh, Super Power Dragonite is? I actually have a favorite thing about Super Power Dragonite. The thing I like the best about the dumb thing. The thing I like best about Super Power Dragonite is that now I know they're not running hurricane <laughs> and a fairy type basically walls it. All right. That's, that's, that's pretty good. I'm not throwing superpowers at you, buddy. Like lick is going to lick is going to kill you. I mean, I get two superpowers here. I might, but Timer's not up. I mean, if I get clapped by a Hurricane Dragonite right here, I will smile. I'll smile a little bit, but you know. I it's It's quite unlikely these days. It's way, way less likely than it used to be. Oh, that's awkward. <laughs> it wasn't dead. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute. It didn't die to the second superpower. <laughs> it doesn't have a move, but you know, still, it feels a little awkward. Moon blast and then slap. GG's. <laughs> All right, sure. But I do like that. It really takes the pressure off. Now, again, pro tip for, for some of you who are new to battling. Somebody asked me about um, faking an earthquake and stuff earlier. You really, really, really should consider. Um, you really should consider the possibility that, um, like, look at your Pokemon's move sets and understand if there's something your opponent might want to be afraid of, and pretend like you have it. Right. 
Exactly, Neophoba. See? See? It takes the pressure off. It takes the pressure off. But yeah, if you've got a floor just, this has been fun. Floor just has been really fun. And do not underestimate how much damage Moonblast does. Moonblast does like 66% to an Excadrill, just as a heads up. It fucking slaps it. It's a great move. Uh, Toj. Okay. Uh, I don't love this, but it is what it is. What we're going to do is we're going to Moonblast this thing, and then we're going to switch. We'll save swap to Snorlax after Moonblasting. We're going to come on in, and we're going to blast away. We either get a shield, or this thing is very low, and any of our other Pokemon can pick it off. Yeah, that's fine. And they got the debuff. That's great. We probably could have stayed in with the debuff, but I think what they're going to do is they're going to go to a... Uh, oh, they're going to throw at me? By all means, with the debuff on, chip away. Yeah, there's the flamethrower. Fine. It's... I mean, like, yeah, we're taking a lot of damage here, but we're just going to farm this down and... <laughs> Fine. What's your back line that you were so afraid of Snorlax? Uh, Swampert. Okay, well. We're at literally 100 energy, so that's fun. The question I have for myself now is, is the Florgis or the Gyarados more important? Like, quite literally, I don't know which of my remaining Pokemon is actually more important. You think it's Florgis? I mean, we're going to bring the Gary in against this anyway. We're to the point now where this thing took so much damage, it doesn't matter. Ah, it's Primarina. It's a Waterfall Primarina, too. Okay. Uh, I think we fish for another debuff here. Ooh, and they didn't shield. Let's go. No debuff, but I think we're going to be in good shape. Yeah, this team doesn't have a steel type on it. Yeah, Hoff took all our Moonblast debuffs away. I'm very sad about it. Come on. Come on. Be aggressive. Oh, rip. It's fine. Obviously, we would have liked to, uh, we would have liked to kill that, but we'll take it. I think we just went 5-0, oh, by the way. Remember when I was like, yesterday, I was like, gosh, I really dislike, I really dislike copycat in this format. Yeah, this is why. This is why I dislike copycat in this format. One, because you don't get practice. And two, once you get practice with a team in this format, you just fucking clap. Oh, good. I got a wingle for my 5-0. Oh. Hooray. I'm so thrilled. To be fair, we did get a Moonblast debuff in that game. We did actually get a Moonblast debuff. Hey, look. Uh, we hit Veteran. <laughs> uh, all right. Well, I guess I guess that's good. The Guzma Pants. 